used to. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the edition of Mr. E Says. It's been a long time since I posted something. Today, I want to talk about something that's pretty special. The announcement of Floyd Mayweather Jr.'s next fight. We all waited for such a long time for his big announcement. But, you know, before I get to the big announcement, I want to talk. I want to do a little recap on the mayweather Pacquiao fight. You know, it made me sad watching that fight. We waited all those years to watch it. Jamie Foxx sang the National Anthem, and he sucked balls. So right away, after Jamie Foxx sang the National Anthem and sucked balls, you pretty much figured we're in for a really rough night. So there it is. Fight everybody waited for. Turned to a fucking racetrack. Floyd doing his usual, let me run and run and run. Pacquiao was hurt. You know, uh, Pacquiao's wife was cutting fucking chicken heads out ringside, crying and shit. You know what? The sad thing about this fight is Floyd Mayweather was smart. He waited years and years and years and years. Because at one point, Manny Pacquiao was pretty scary. You know, he was a beast. He was like the next coming of Mike Tyson. He was that guy. He was pretty much the baddest man on the fucking planet at one point. But Mayweather waited. And waited and waited and waited until Manny got older. He made a lot of money. And made us look like a bunch of fools. It was a funny situation, you know. I wasn't going to pay for the fight. But my uncle called me. He's like, hey, Mijo, come, come see the fight, Mijo. I'm going to have it here. I was like, hell yeah, man. You know, I got my fucking case of beer. We all went over there. So when I get to the gate, there's a security guard. He says, it's going to be 30 bucks, bro. I'm like, 30 bucks? It's my uncle's house. He said, come on, bro. It's Mayweather Pacquiao. It was getting close to the main event, so I had to pay. It's okay. I forgive my uncle. You know what? Times are kind of rough, and he needed to make a quick buck. End of story. So pretty much that fight sucked balls. So I'm going to get to this fight. Floyd Mayweather decided, he's like, he was calling up guys. He was calling up, uh, he was calling up uh, Oscar De La Hoya. He was calling uh, Luis Castillo. He's like, hey, Castillo, let's have a third fight. Castillo versus Mayweather, three. What do you think? They all declined. He even called Julio Cesar Chavez. And I'm not talking about junior. He fucking called senior. He said, hey, hey, senior, let's fight. Come on, we'll make a lot of money. Senior thought about it for a minute. He thought, you know, I might come out of retirement and kick this fucker's ass and show my son what balls really are all about. You know, fuck fucking Chavez Jr. I'll get to that another day. Fucking douche. Anyway, let me get to the point. Mayweather versus Andre Birdo. He finally calls Andre Birdo. Andre Birdo. What else is Andre going to say? Uh, no, nah, I don't want to fight you. So he goes for broke. A shitty fight. I thought to myself, I was like, oh man, maybe this is the fight that's going to be the freebie. The one that's going to be on CBS. Oh, fuck no. Floyd's a fucking greedy motherfucker. You know, he wants that on pay-per-view too. And we're a bunch of dumb motherfuckers because we're going to buy it. But not this motherfucker. No way. You know, so he calls Andre. Andre lost to fucking... Robert Guerrero, you know, he lost to Victor Ortiz for crying out loud. But Victor Ortiz sucks ass too. They should bury Victor Ortiz and Chavez Jr. Fucking make this big asshole and bury those fuckers. They're not boxers. Bunch of imposters. But you know what? That's the fight we got. So we got to deal with it. It's going to be pretty much Floyd running and running and running. Getting that victory. And then he's going to be like, oh, you know, that's my style. That's my style. That's how it goes. And we're all just a bunch of fools. because We're going to keep buying it. So please, I'm asking you this. Do not buy the fight. Stream it online for free. Do whatever you got to do. But do not buy the fight. Let's boycott this fight. There's a better fight that's going to come up, hopefully. Cotto and Canelo, hopefully. You know, I, I would have thought maybe Mayweather would have grown some balls for once. And maybe call somebody out. Be like, Triple G, you want to fight me, Triple G? Man, let's fucking fight. Let's fight at 157. Let's fight at 160. I don't care. Because that's what real champions do, bro. Not running around like a bunch of little bitches. Counting their money. That's pretty much all I got. Thank you very much for watching. I'm out! I woke up in the morning, hopped on a train, I saw my man, he had a hell in